Hi, welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to show you how to install and configure Zimra mail server on Ubuntu 20.4 LTS. So let's get started. First, we need to configure our domain. Uh, we need to configure the MX record and the host record. Before that, let's check that we have our MX record set. My domain mailserverguru.com have no MX record defined. To set the MX record, we need to define the MX record and the host record at our domain panel. I have purchased my domain from GoDaddy. So let's log into the GoDaddy domain panel. On the domain panel, we need to go to the DNS server settings or DNS configuration. This is our DNS records. First of all, we need to set the A record. My host name is Zmail, points to my mail server IP. So the host record is assigned. Now let's add the MX record. We have set our host A record and the MX record for the domain. Now if we check again from the MX toolbox, now we can see that our MX record is defined to the host name zmail.mailserverguru.com and the host name maps to the IP address. This is my mail server IP address. So our domain panel setup is okay. Now let's go to our server. On the server, we need to set our host name. My host name is Zmail, and I have set also the FQDN zmail.mailserverguru.com. So my DNS domain name is mailserverguru.com. So the system full FQDN is zmail.mailserverguru.com, and I have internet connectivity. Let's see my operating system version. This is 20.4 Ubuntu. First of all, we need to do the update. Update is OK. Now let's do the upgrade. Our package upgrade is done. So first we did the APTK update, then upgrade the system. Now let's upload the latest Zimbra package. As of today, this is the latest package version for the Ubuntu 20.4. Now let's untar the package let's shorten the name now we need to run the install.sh It is asking, do you agree with the term? Yes. Hit enter. Use Zimmer package repository. Yes. And these are the Zimmer packages. It will install. Now it's asking, select the package to install. Install Zimmer LDAP. Yes. Logger, MTA, DNS cache, SNMP, store, Apache, spell, memcache, proxy, drive Zimra MFD is beta we don't need this in the chat the system will be modified continue yes so 
these are the package the installer will install now it's downloading the packages now the package downloading is complete now it's proceeding with the installing repo packages now it is installing the local packages installing extra package now running post installation configuration it shows an error dns error resolving mx for zmail.mail it is trying to find the mx record for the whole fqdn it is suggested that the domain name have an mx record configured let's copy the domain name change domain name yes so the domain name should be mailserverguru.com only the system finds a port conflict about the 53 port it is going to install the zimra dns cache so on the system if you see on the 53 port the system d resolve daemon it is listening on the 53 port that's why it is uh, showing the port conflict error so we need to stop this daemon right now system ctl stop system d resolved now if we check there is no resolved daemon here 53 port is free now so if we hit press enter now it's okay now it's asking for the admin password setup so we have to choose the option 7 now option 4 for the password we can copy the password default is okay for me now we have done setup here this is the final configuration so now let's go to the previous menu and it's asking configuration complete press a to apply save configuration data to file yes just hit enter save config in file the system will be modified yes now it's creating the local SSL. Now it is doing the post installation configurations. Mostly on the LDAP configuration. Now it is creating the domain mailsavagu.com, creating the root alias, postmaster alias, creating spam user, virus quarantine user. Configuring SNMP down, setting up syslog conf. Now it's starting the services. Now it's installing the zimlets. Now it's finished installing the common zimlets. Now restarting the mailbox. Now the installation is almost done. Notify Zimra for the installation. No. Now the configuration is complete. Press return to exit. Now let's see the all the services are running. services are in running state now we can log into the web panel the zimra control panels url will be the full fqdn colon 7071 slash zimra admin hit enter admin let's go to manage create an account
click finish so we have created an account munna at mailsuperguru.com now let's send a mail from gmail let's compose system test one system test one click send now you can see mail came from munnavai at gmail.com to munna at mailsuperguru.com and it is delivery okay now if we go to the web mail we can see the view mail here you can see we previously sent some mail and also the system test one reached to the inbox so our mail server is okay and our configuration is working just fine so we are done here thank you for being with me if you still didn't subscribe to my channel please subscribe it will encourage me more to create more videos for you so i'll see you on the next video bye